Hey guys, Bush Tech here with another YouTube tutorial. And this is for YouTubers for the Nightbot. Yes. And let's get started. Today we're going to go uh, work on the protection side of Nightbot. Uh, the spam protection. Once you get logged in, to uh, Nightbot at nightbot.tv. You're going to notice over here, make sure that on the right hand side that you are logged in. Then you're going to go over here to spam protection. Now, this is very important because when you first start this bot up, everything is enabled. So if you don't want or you allow things like uh, emotes and caps and things like that. You want to make sure you disable these things. Now, one of the main things I would suggest doing is enabling uh, blacklist words and phrases. Um, you want to make sure that's enabled and then go over here to options on the right hand side. Pop up will appear and up here you have your blacklist words. Now, I'm not going to type these in because they're very bad words and everything like that. Now, um, you can either do by word or anything that goes with that word. As you can see here, they have test. So anything that starts with test or like it says testing, test Torino or anything like that. So you can kind of guess how this is. So you're going to use an asterisk at the end of it. And then at the next word, it's going to be a comma, next words, so on. So you're going to have whatever words these are, and everybody can guess what kind of words I'm talking about. And you also have the opportunity here to get rid of those um, people that come into your chat to advertise uh, naughty stuff. <laughs> and we all know what kind of bots those are. And if you check this here, it will check the blacklist words and see if anything starts with those words in their username. If it does, they won't talk at all. Nightbot will time them out. Um, and make sure they're not allowed to talk. Now we go down here and it says timeout length, 600 seconds. That is plenty enough time for your mods to handle the issue. So you should have no trouble uh, dealing with this. Now here is the exempt user levels. So as you can see, um, the you can have it set to owner. Only you're allowed to say the bad words if that's the case, but you know what I mean. You can have your mods. Um, I wouldn't suggest anything under a mod being able to to do this. And I would I actually suggest to do it silent. That means when somebody comes in and says these bad words, nobody knows it um, except for you and maybe the mods because it's going to do it silently so it's going to send it's going to time that person out so where nobody will see it in chat and this comes in handy when you have a lot of bad stuff going on in your channel like a lot of uh, these bots come in and start spamming this is perfect for that and once this is done you just hit submit boom and it's done now let's move on to excessive caps and if you don't want to know what excessive caps is it's when you use your sentences in all caps now there are a lot of people that speak in caps and it used to be offensive because it used to mean you were yelling at a person but nowadays uh People use cell phones where they keep the caps lock on so they can see the, the, the letters and things. So this is totally up to you if you want to do this. 
and the timeout length is 600 seconds. And you can set this to whatever number you want to. Me, I would disable this because it's it's a lot of times when you're doing lives and things you tell people to speak in all caps if you have a question now if you do this they're going to time out so you'll never get no question so i would suggest to turn this off now the next one is excessive emotes let's go ahead over here and it says we're going to time out for 600 minutes or seconds <laughs> and how many can you have and it's right now is at three now i would suggest to keep this under or yeah, I, I, under 10 we'll put it nine because i think 10 and over youtube kind of gets mad about that so keep it if this is something that you want to enable if not don't worry about it uh, disable it have them spam all the emotes th that you want it's all, all up to you you can keep you can like i said you can you can keep it silent so nobody knows this or you can type a message uh hey lay off the the emotes you're only allowed to do nine <laughs> or so something like that go ahead and hit submit and you're good if you don't if you don't want th this disable it now on this next one i suggest everybody doing this um and this is a whitelist so th this is if you have uh certain members or certain uh viewers that you allow to post links but you don't want to give a mod you can you can give them this um all you all you do is is type in permission um and their their name and it automatically goes in here or you can type it in here from here if not then anybody that posts a link will uh, get timed out and also you can keep it silent so nobody here sees this or you can relay a message saying sorry we don't allow links being posted in chat something like that and I, like i said i would suggest keeping this to where nobody can post that stuff and then we have excessive symbols now i would also uh, suggest keeping this one on because um, there are certain symbols that they will post in in a in a line that will be inappropriate stuff um, and again, you can determine how many symbols it is that you want. You can, it can be eight, 20, whatever. Anything under eight or over eight would get flagged and they would get timed out. And that, like I said, that's up to you. You can silence it again or you can do a custom message. Um, go ahead and submit this depending on what you want to do. Uh, this one, I it's already disabled so i wouldn't worry about it um it doesn't work with on youtube anyway so once that's done your spam protection is covered um like i said it's something before you, you actually do a live is something that you need to do with this because if not you're gonna get a awakening because a lot of people will get timed out in your your live until the next one catch you guys later